Oh man, it's Spencer again with the Vetris Crawford Realty Group. We got hail here in Oregon right now, technically in Salem, Oregon. We're at a brand new development, new construction community. There's houses all around us. Some have been bought, but there's probably about seven lots left. This is a beautiful home with great characteristics and designs that builders today in 2023 are using. And just to show you this front door, very simple, single door, but all glass, very tall. Now, let's walk into this home. We have a dark wood tone, but look at all of this, this uh, beautiful paneling. This is throughout this whole home. We open up to the right, double swing doors. With this paneling, and then this carpet. This carpet I've seen in a lot of new constructions right now, it's a very heavy, dense carpet, and it's great for insulation. Here we got storage, coat hangers, half bath. We're gonna come around to the kitchen. Beautiful island, massive. These are quartz countertops. And if you want to know more about this home in regards to the price, I'll tell you at the very end of the video, I want you to go through this video with me and guess what this home is for sale at. Here in South Salem, Oregon, new construction community, and it's 2,200 square feet, three bed, three bath, two, three car garage. This sliding glass door is massive. If there's one thing I love about homes, especially these new constructions, it is the natural light and vaulted ceilings. This exposed beam is exactly what I'd be wanting and it ties in perfectly with the flooring. Here's a long view. Oh, and one other thing. This is easily missed. This whole back wall, shiplap. And then you have this beautiful stone here. Professionally staged, ready to be lived in. This home is completed. All the bedrooms are gonna be upstairs and you have that half office with half bath downstairs. We'll finish the video with me going outside and just showing you the backyard view. There is a covered deck. I'm gonna start off with the hallway bathroom. Look at this flooring material. It's a nice look-alike, quartz countertops. Good sized bedrooms, I would say. Double door closet, white, very white home. High ceiling craftsman style entry doorways. Similar carpets, same exact carpets, excuse me, as what we see downstairs. Got a walk-in closet, bedroom number two. Laundry room. All of the water spaces have the same flooring. It's a waterproof material. Bolted ceiling in the master. And definitely I can tell the insulation here is different than all of the other bedrooms. Double vanity, massive mirror. I love the way this home was staged. Look at this tile. Look at this pattern. This is nice. This reminds me of the uh, 1960 builds. That pattern is very in right now. I've seen that multiple times. This is a deep shower. Almost as deep as they come around here. I've noticed in a lot of new constructions they are getting deeper, wider, and all tile. Sometimes we're still seeing multiple shower heads. This is just a simple one, but all glass. Massive walk-in closet. Massive, guys. All right, let's go downstairs and check out the backyard and see if the backyard's doable. Because everybody I talk to says, you know what, I just, I don't know about these new constructions. They're so expensive right now. 
and I don't have much of a yard. I got a dog. Here in Salem, we have beautiful city parks. I'm not saying you can't have a yard if you have a new constructed home, but what I'm saying is there's alternatives. We have Minto Brown that's a four minute drive from this property. We are in South Salem, guys. This is where the governor of Oregon lives on a few blocks away on the, in the same hillside. Trek deck, beautiful railing all the way throughout. Look at that. Property line is stringed. I'm just gonna walk. The rain kind of stopped. The whole yard is irrigated. And this is what you got. You got arbivitas on that far edge, connecting to those. That's your property line in the back. And then this string, if you can see it. All right, we're back outside in the front of the house. I gave you the cliffhanger. What do you think this property is worth? Well, here is the sales price. $739,900. That's pretty much basically the standard right now. I would say score footage wise, this one's a little less than other ones in this community. I see this one across uh, the roadway. That guy will probably be more upward 700s. Um, but that is what we are seeing right now in a lot of these new construction communities. A lot of the material, the insides of these homes, they are kind of all going to be the same. A lot of shiplap, a lot of wall paneling, mainly all the same texturing within the home. But what I'm really loving is the open spaces, but more garage space as well. That's something a lot of people are forgetting about. This has that three car garage and there's a tandem garage. So it goes all the way back. So you have even additional room. If you guys are interested in moving to Oregon, feel free to contact Mariah and I both. We are on the same team, Vetris Crawford Realty. We do these home tours every week this one just so happens to be a brand new construction here in salem we want to make sure you guys are aware and knowing these new construction communities this happens to be in south salem you can contact us in the links below our website should be down there as well on to the next one have a great day